Well, it's another sun and fun from Blakeland, Florida. And you know, for as many years as Garmin has been doing the show, you could pretty much always count on them to bring a major product announcement along. This year is no different, but what they've done this year is kind of different. They brought an entire airplane. This Grumman Tiger behind me has got a new major product. To learn more, let's go find Jessica Koss. So Jessica, you guys flew this uh, Grumman Tiger all the way from Kansas to put on display here at the show uh, because? Because we've achieved STC for the G3X Touch and nearly 500 single engine piston aircraft. And uh, that's big news because this uh, glass cockpit uh, started out in the experimental world. It's a G3X Touch, but now it's STC'd for, as you said, a bunch of different airplanes. What is this configuration and what are some of the other configurations? So the configuration we're looking at here in the Tiger is a 10.6 inch display alongside a 7 inch G3X touch display alongside GTN 650 and a G5 electronic flight instrument and it of course includes the GFC 500 autopilot. So we're not limited by this panel configuration for display options and you're not limited to IFR. You could do a VFR panel too? That's right. We have four configuration options. Um, you can do a single 10 inch display, a single 7 inch display, a 10 inch and a 7 inch display like we're showing in the Tiger, or dual 7 inch displays. And if you want to do a VFR option, you can just do a standalone G3X touch um, system, or you could pair it with an IFR navigator such as the GTN 650, 750, um, the new GPS 175 or GNX 375, or the GNS 430W or 530W. So as you can see in this Tiger, uh, the STC also includes removing uh, all of the factory engine gauges, including the fuel gauges. That's right. Engine information is available as an option, and you can display it along the side on the 10-inch display or even alongside the top of the 7-inch display. So you have a lot of configuration options as it relates to displaying your engine information. So the STC includes removing the vacuum system and um, making this airplane completely electric. That's right. With the G5 electronic flight instrument and the dual G3X touch displays, we have complete redundancy, not only between G3X touch, but also with G5. And even further, G5 offers some additional benefits, such as Barrow's sync and altitude pre-select sync. So any information that you input on G3X Touch automatically cross-fills over to G5. And if you lose a primary flight display, the G5 will stay powered up because it has a backup battery, and it'll also work with the autopilot? That's right. So if you were to lose your primary displays, the autopilot would kick off temporarily, but when you re-engage it, it'll engage with G5 and allow you to fly a fully coupled approach or flight plan or whatever you're going. So understanding that there are several different configurations of this system, what's the typical starting price of the base system? The starting price for a single 7-inch G3X touch display is $7,995, and the starting price for a 10-inch G3X touch display is $9,995. Um, you could come see this airplane on display here at the show. Where will it be located throughout the week? This airplane will be located right outside Hangar D, closest to the runway. Reporting for Aviation Consumer and AvWeb, I'm Larry Anglosano. Thanks for watching, and uh, thanks to Jessica Koss for the overview.